Hi there. Driving to Brussels right now. It's Friday. It's almost three o'clock and I've had a pretty shitty week. I derive a lot of my happiness and satisfaction from being productive and I've had a really unproductive week. I have overslept almost every day, stayed up late, watched a lot of junk TV, uh, I ate at McDonald's three times this week, and I had pizza twice. Uh, I just generally feel like shit because of it, and, and I, I'm pretty sure I know why I feel like shit or why I haven't gotten off my ass and done something, and it's that I'm trying to start something new right now. I'm trying to start a new project, and it's really hard, uh, and this is getting in the way, or actually more appropriately this, the primitive base of my brain that is constantly telling me, this is stupid, just do what you've already done in the past, that's, how you, what, that's what you know how to do, this is hard, this is new, this is going to take a lot of, this is going to be risky, you might lose money, people might judge you, they might say you're stupid, and all those things are flashing through my mind all day long and it all combines to just keep me from actually starting and it just tears me up inside I'm at least recording this video <laughs> the weeks over so fuck it I'll try again next week but at least I got this video to put out there hopefully I get the courage up to really dig in next week keep going I went on a big vacation in January and I kind of really hate big vacations because it totally fucks up my sense of rhythm in my professional life. And I you know, might spend a month or two or three months really honing a rhythm of get up early, be productive, do the hard work first, and then I get back and it's just, you know, Facebook. It's easy to go on Facebook and just look at people's dumb shit much harder to go and take something that's in here and actually make it out into the world but next week hopefully I'll do that you know the project which uh, I, you know I'll, I'll go into more detail in another video but the one thing I did get done this week is I got a little intro made for it and well I'll just I'll show you the intro right now So that's the intro, the project, the kind of umbrella of what I want to spend the next 20 or 30 or 40 or hopefully 50 years of my life doing is making education better in America. I, I think the opportunity that we're giving young people is, is a pile of sh dog shit. And I want to change that. So the umbrella of all these little projects that I'm going to spend the next 50 years working on is Real Brick Road. The name of the first piece of work under that umbrella is the Walker Challenge. The Walker Challenge and Real Brick Road are all about courage. It's all about stopping our learning by consuming and starting us learning by creating and, and helping students at a very young age create a habit of being able to say here I made this in school and out, out of school and not being afraid of people saying oh that's stupid oh you're dumb oh you're fired or whatever it is that they can say here I made this what do you think and that people can come back and say oh you know what it's not for me but it's cool or or it is for me and let me help you out and develop it some more and so that's the culture that I want to start creating. And Real Brick Road and, and first in the pipeline, the Walker Challenge is what I'm going to use to do that. It's amazing. How long has this video been going? 5.22. It's amazing how <laughs> just hitting record and making something 
and five minutes of your time, of my time, to do this make, has made me feel so much better. I feel honestly a thousand times better right now. Gonna have a good weekend in Brussels, and then Monday, back on the grind. More next week.